Okay, well done you. Here we are, the final practice sheet. So you've done very well um, in coming this far. Um, this is notes in the first three frets and playing scales. So this week we spoke about um, from quite an early stage getting getting the names of the notes in the first three frets um, as something that we're quite familiar with. Um, it is really useful as you progress um, with your playing um, over the next um, eight weeks now. Um, and beyond that to know um, if you've got a finger in the third fret rather than us describing it as third finger, third fret to be able to just say play a C. Um, it's slightly more simple that way. Um, a C note that is rather than a chord. A chord being a collection of notes, three or more notes, a note just being a single tone. Um, so we have this. Um, this is just a um, an opportunity for us to write out the note the note names in the first three frets. Um, so for those that wasn't in class, I'm going to go through them now. Um, so this one here is an E. That's an F. That's a G. That's an A. That's a B. That's a C. That's a D. That's an E. That's an F. That's a G. A. B. C. D, E, F, and then finally down here on his own is a G. So if you write all of those note names in, um, and then just start memorising them, take it um, two strings per week, sorry, yeah, yeah that sounds about right, two strings per week, um, and you will notice that there is a logic to that, there is a pattern that forms, um, it's just going through the musical alphabet, so it's not too difficult. Musical alphabet being A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and then it starts again at A. Um, once you have wrote down the note names, so this was the final note name that we wrote down, Mr. G, um, we have this here. So the next four bars, one, two, three, four, and this is a C major scale, so you need to write C major here. Um, and the C major scale um, is there for us to commit to memory. We're going to be using it at around about week four or week five to start making our own music. Um, so play through it, get it committed to memory to help you learn the note names. Um, you might want to say the note names out loud as you're playing it. Um, not the most exciting of sheets at this point, but once we start using scales um, to develop melodies and make our own music, you will see that it actually does become really cool and, and very exciting. Um, so a little bit of music theory, an introduction to um, the first steps that we need, I guess, to be able to play around with music theory. Um, so yeah, just put in the time with that this week, um, a bit of a must, really. Um, enjoy the rest of your practicing and I will see you next week.